Hi guys, I'm Jake Cuenca. Hi, ako si Mikoy Morales. Hi, I'm Neil Nodalo. Archie Adamos. This is Gold Aceron. Palabas tayo. If Maida could talk, siguro sabi niya the hardest time that he's ever had. He. <laughs> Nalagyan akong pronoun. He's ever had would be probably the time when he was really insecure. And he didn't really... When he would just, I don't know, not believe in himself in all aspects of his being. Kung nakakapagsalita yung titi ko, siguro sasabihin niya na hindi mahalaga kung malaki, maliit, or wala, or meron kang titi. Ang mahalaga is yung pagkatao mo, yung pagkalalaki mo, kung paano ka sa family mo, sa friends mo, and sa community mo. Uh, sa, tungkol sa pagbibigay ko sa kanya sa kaligayan, siguro masasabi, masasabi niya lang siguro, thank you. Salamat. My dick is happiest when it's bigger. And uh, when, when you have the girl right in front of you. Oh, I would think. <laughs> um, that's not a pleasure itself. I think we didn't do, we didn't do too bad. <laughs> I think I'd say that like, um, not too bad. Yeah. <laughs> Be probably proud to say na, hey, I smell normal. <laughs> like I smell like how addiction smell like. <laughs> Sobrang saya si Junjun tuwing nakakakita siya ng mga Juni. Charot! <laughs> Pinapaliguan and everything. Of course, I take care of it. And very well spoiled to pagdating nun. <laughs> but, but there are times na aminado siya na parang, Ooh, medyo mainit. Okay, sige, dito tayo ngayon. <laughs> Siguro masaya si Junjun kapag nakakita siya ng ibang magpapaligaya sa kanya. Siguro, mahilig kasi siya sa kuweba. So, pag nakahanap siya ng kuweba na pwede niyang tuluyan, Dun siya magpapahinga, mas magiging masaya siya. What would my dick say when he embarrassed me? Are you really asking me that question? Because what I would say is, F*** you, you really destroyed me. I tell him to just shut up and don't do anything because I don't know how I can change things. Uh, what would my dick say after the last huge hangover? Oh, maybe... Too, I, haven't had, I haven't had alcohol in two years, so I think maybe the last hangover was maybe it's the last one. Maybe that's what he said. <laughs> mga lalaki specifically na mga nakakalimutan nila yung mga pagkalalaki nila. Siguro, make sure lang nabalikan natin kung saan tayo nagsimula, kung papaano tayo uh, ginawa at uh, binild ng ating mga magulang. Siguro, ma maaalala natin kung, kung papaano maging isang uh, maginoo or mabuting isang lalaki. If my dick could talk, siguro, ano, nagre-reklamo na siya kasi gamit na gamit na siya. <laughs> Kung nakakasayaw si Junjun, siguro ang gagawin ni Junjun na sayo ganito. Break it down, yo. Break it down, yo. Cool. Ayan. Oh, it will always be jazz. Just like this, just like that, just anything. That one moment of pride together that I've had with my dick is, um... <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, pretty proud of ourselves, I guess. <laughs> the biggest lesson that my dick has taught me was, um, I think, I mean, just regards to the material and regards to, you know, everything that I've learned from it, I think I would say that, um, get rid of your ego. Yeah, get out of your way. Dapat ang titi natin, tinuturing natin siyang treasure. Hey. Alam mo naman na to, but you are not what you think you are sometimes. Because you're the best. And you're the only one I got. Come on. Dapat hindi lang basta basta kung saan pinapasok. Just be yourself. Maybe that's the best thing or the, the most important thing I learned about this show. It's just really be yourself in front of people, even behind closed doors. Like who you are there. Like fuck norms. Like, Fuck stereotypes. Just be your fucking self. As Archie, it has taught me that, you know, you can make fun of many things and most of all, you can make people happy. But as dudes, I think what it does would be to make you love even more. Very proud of yung dick ko is yung by sharing awareness na maintindihan yung mga katulad po namin ng mga trans men. Kung ano yung mga pinagdadaanan na namin, namin dalawa ng titi ko. Na-explain dito um, bawat 
bawat iba't ibang uri ng mga tite. What my dick is most proud about this show is is that the the venture and the journey na ginawa niya with Viral. To be honest, like it's such an honor and pleasure to be part of their first baby, first big baby, and 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 turns out to be like a couple of dicks, you know, on stage, and and yun. I think and this will go down for me as 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 one of the best things I've ever done in my life, really. Um, it's most proud of all the people behind it. I think um, we just had um, we just had a whole meeting with everyone here, the whole production and staff and. For me, it's just um, we've been a family for the past two months, and just to see it, just to see everyone together, and just to see this thing come true, and to make dreams come true together. Um, yeah, um, I think we're all pretty proud. Pinang yeah. grateful ng titi ko sa show na to, kasi nga po na nabigyan namin yung mga tao, parang nag ano kami, eye opener kami sa kanila, at yun dun naging grateful ng titi ko. Grateful for. the craft of creating and recreating with people you share same passions with and this opportunity really is it's been one hell of a ride like it's a dream come true for my dick to have this opportunity um my dick is most grateful for is this play for, for theater for the craft um for seeing people again for having an audience being able to perform being able to being able to share and being able to have this platform again Um, siguro sasabihin ng titi ko dun sa mga positive reviews is magsasabog ng maraming confetti. Niyon. Nila besan. All the rave reviews, all the comments and all the everything, um, all the feedback that everyone's been giving to us. Just thank you so much from the bottom of our hearts. Um, Like I said, this is this is the main reason why I do theater is making small dreams come true like this, and to have it been um, to have it been accepted the way that it is, um, to have people say the words that they say about our play, it's just um, it, it's just so heartwarming, and and for me ultimately, I'm just grateful, and it just pushes me to want to do more theater. Yes, my dick is grateful for it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Wow, <laughs> wow, ang sa sabihin ng titi ko. My dick would say, any more, any other shows? That's it. No, we gotta go around the world. Nagpapasalamat po talaga ako sa lahat ng sumuporta po sa amin. Sa buong LGBTQIA plus community. Thank you so much po. Maraming 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 salamat po sa lahat ng sumuporta po sa TikTok. My gratitude and thanks for watching our play. And for those who haven't yet, we might have a run again. Hi guys, thank you for supporting TikTok. Really, 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 really. Like, like, thank you for coming. <laughs> and, 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 uh, I don't know. Just abangan yun na lang ko ano pa mas sunod na mga yare and 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 I hope you're st you still be there. You still be there to support us and, and follow us through. Thank you everyone um, for supporting TikTok and for supporting V Roll Media Ventures. Um, thank you so much for all the love and for all the time for the time that you guys shared with us inside the theater. And um, thank you so much from the bottom of our hearts. Palabas tayo. Palabas tayo. Palabas tayo. Palabas tayo. Palabas tayo. Palabas tayo.